Hello there, and welcome back to some more ukulele. In the last episode, what we did was we found ourselves pushing some muddy ball and hating life. But now everything's okay again. Now all's all right with the world because I don't have to do that shit anymore. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. It was shit. Um. Now. Yeah, the whistling is happening for Quills as well, but that's fine. But if I have to be that close to find the whistling, then I'm already there. I've already got all the Quills. I'm going to go through, all the way through Tribal Stack Tropics just to listen to one guy whistling. There's some Quills I didn't have before, so that's good. How many am I missing now, just, just to see? Three and nine. Not bad. Two are, one's from the ghost and one's inside the station, so there's one more that I haven't got. That doesn't seem too bad to me. It seems pretty good. And... Okay. Moving on. Why do, you, why do you think that was a good idea, Joey? That's a good question, actually. I um, don't fucking know. Right, so. There must be some eggs somewhere around here that I can feed to the hungry boy. It's the only thing that makes sense. Somewhere. Ah, uh, here they are. Right. <laughs> Give me. Right. Now there's one more ghost. Somewhere. Where? Who knows? It's not the slippery ghost, is it? No, the slippery ghost has already been caught. By slippery, I mean tends to like running off. Mine. Right, we're going back up to the top. Again, good vantage point, just to see what we're, what we're missing. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Come here. Okay. I mean, that building is plenty imposing, but it is all closed up because I've done it already. I think I'm about done, but let's explore just a little bit right at the top, just to see. Because there could be quills that are just hidden in bits that I've already done. That are now hidden away. For example. Could be over there. Could be over here. Although that's new, new, that's all new stuff. So we need to go right the way back over there to get back to old stuff. Didn't fall. You can fall pretty much infinitely and not take damage like that. That's pretty good shit. What I'd really like to do is go to World Four and learn a new move. Because I need some moves to go back here and every other world to finish up some shit that I haven't been able to do. 
So the first order of business is just to get back there. Now I'm super dead, right? There's no way back into the level from here. Doesn't look like it. I fell off the level. Now usually you'd have just, this would just be super kill swamp and you'd just instantly die if you touched it, but apparently the game designers didn't think of that, so i got to watch my HP deplete slowly as punishment for my sin. Um, well actually, if we're just going back to the start, let's use the handy convenient pipe that the game designers actually gave us to use. Instead of being a, a dickweed and deciding, oh, I know better than the game developer, of course. I'll do it my way. Mwah. Everyone's like, really? Wee. Right, okay. To World 4. I'm going to get the smashy glass move and then I'm going to go straight back to world one again. Remember that I wasn't supposed to get to world four before now, so I wasn't supposed to be able to do the camera stuff or anything. But now I very much certainly can. You like that video game? Yeah, I'm alright, mate. Good. I do like this song a lot. Yum. Well, we're going to what looks like a pizza wheel. It's clearly not a pizza wheel, but it looks like one. Oh, this is Kashino. I've heard bad things about Capital Kashino. I've heard it's not a very good level, but we'll uh, we'll see. Never judge a book by its uh, cover. We might actually like it, so we'll see for ourselves. These dice are solid. Got it. The fuck is? Where am I? This is scary. This is where all the books are kept. Is this where the final level is? Security is really less. He said it like seven times. But right, let's go in here. What does this do? Oh. Can't do that from being seen. Good. Okay. Let's open the doorway. There's going to be a page around here somewhere. There always is. Golden ball? Is there a golden cup? A golf cup? Where's that? Is there one? There might not be. Doesn't seem to be on first glance. Okay. Now for the first time I think this series, we're going to take a little break. I'll be right back. Two seconds. Okay, I'm back. Hello. Uh, where were we? We're going to open Capital Casino. You'll need ten of us pages to unlock this world. Do you want to unlock Capital Casino? It's a poker chip, I guess. Not a pizza slice. Don't forget, you can choose to expand this world once you've found eleven pages. Just stand on the Grand Tome Switch when you're ready. Well, think about it, pamphlet. I'm not quite sure Yuka's up to the harder challenges in the expanded world. Whee! I'm just looking for Trouser and then I'm fucking out of here. Don't worry.
Just a nice skill check before you even start. Warning, under construction. Please enjoy the main hall attraction. Enjoy a turn to your room. That's where the expanded world's gonna be, I guess. I don't want to get any quilts or anything in here until I've seen my boy. My boy Trouser. He is a slippery serpent, but he's a good guy. He's a good lad. Warning, under construction. Please enjoy the main hall or return to your room. Ha ha ha! This is different from the pagey voice. The pagey voice sounds like this and is staggered in his delivery, whereas the signs are quite confident. It's different. Trust me. Don't know what that is. Doesn't really matter, I guess. That's an upset slot machine. Okay. Have I done a full lap of the area yet? No. That is a Mario 64 race flag. It's another sad slot machine. Where's my boy Trouser at? Oh, there's the the knights of the old pork rub. <laughs> the port click. <laughs> is that one wearing a sombrero? <laughs> I guess it is. Filthy. Absolutely filthy. Okay. Of course, this would be the one world where Trouser isn't just immediately in front of me and I couldn't just see him. There's Dr. Puzz. There's an archer. Molly Pool's gonna be around here somewhere. Hello. Hello, do we know you? No, absolutely not. You've never heard me, the friendly casino banker before now. Phew, for a minute there, we thought you were that Tubby Renterville villain capital B, he's a right loser. Um, oh yes, a right loser. Huh? Anyway, sirs, allow me to introduce my banking facility. By winning the absolutely not crooked games in this casino, you'll collect tokens that can be cashed in at my bank. If by some miracle you manage to scrape together 10 casino coins, each time you deal exchange the first shiny pagey. Just make sure you don't do anything silly like pay all your pages on black. It'd be a shame if your collection ended up in the banker's vault. Yes, a real crying shame. We'd be very silly if we did that. Yeah, that'd be really dumb. I like capital B move. Mm, yes. Good luck, sirs. Do your best not to go bankrupt in my, um, our casino. Don't be hand needed 10 tokens for a hand over a pagey. Good luck winning that many. Thanks. Uh, what did you say your name was? Jeff. My name's Jeff. Oh, Jeff, such a nice guy. Hey, Trouser. Welcome, me old muckers, to Trouser's most exclusive outlet. Exclusive as in where you're only customers. Yeah. Ah, all this glitz and glamour reminds me of the old yeah. days on the trading floor. Yeah. Trousers high stake trades earned legendary status. Yeah, yeah. They even named a currency after me. <laughs> That's um, really nice, Trouser. Anyway, about your moves. Yeah. Yes, yes, have a look at what's in stock. Reptile Rush. Spin dash like, just like speedy gaming icon Trouser. Yeah. Top choice, Are you sure this is the move you're after? Yes. <laughs> what's this move all about, Trouser? I'm glad you asked. This next move will have to be Spin Dash, just like Speedy Gaming Icon Trouser. That's weird, we haven't seen you move at all yet. Yeah. Fast as lightning I am. Yeah. To use the Reptile Rush, hold right trigger next to charge the attack. Don't yeah. forget to use the L to get big air off ramps yeah. and slides. Uh -huh. We'll keep that in mind, Trouser, thanks. Yeah. Come back soon, you'll definitely need these moves to find your book. <laughs> it's legitimately just a Spin Dash. Good. Okay. Well, back to world one. I told you I was only going to go and find this thing. Uh, 
Okay. Hey. Who are you? Hey. Did I see you before? I don't think I saw him before. Maybe he wasn't there before. You're very angry. Get killed, son. Right. So I haven't learned, you know, toxic recovery yet. But I guess once I've cleared World 4, they will, uh, Charles will have a new move for me for toxic recovery. Hey, <laughs> hey. He's like straight up Wario when he does that. I tried to make all the security guards explosive, but the Minion Workers Union was having none of it. Is there a Minion Workers Union? I guess there must be. Okay. We're moving on. Going to the lofty heights. Of World One. But actually not World One. We're gonna go to World Three first. See if we can't actually super clear a world. It'd be a nice change, wouldn't it? What am I going that way for? So I can get out because I have the ability of licky tongue move. Yum. With the spin dash, I should be able to break through the glass. That's the hope. Who knows if that's true? But that's the hope. I'm missing like what? Nine? Nine quills? And two pages, but one of them is just the ghosts. No, three pages. One of them's the ghosts. Nine quills. So the first thing I'm going to do is go straight to that clear water lake. Should be easy to get to. With my many enhanced mobility options. Just don't fall in the sewer in a part you can't get out of. Like this. No, that's fine. Everything's good. I was a bit spooked for a second there, weren't you? No, I was too, don't worry. Okay. That was the shortcut pipe I could have gone in. But I forget where it is, to be honest. I know it's at the start, but I just forget it's there. And I like it. I like running around in this game, so it's all good. Now, I don't need the uh, piranhas for this bit. Just need to believe in the heart of the cards. Go straight in here. Yeah, you're so much faster when you're in bubble mode. That's interesting. Okay. Broke it. Wasn't exactly the most climactic break of all time, but I did break it. Three, two, one, go! He's made it. Oh, it just opens up and then immediately closes again. Okay. If this is a, if there's another three after this, then we've done it. We've gotten all the pages. I mean, all the quills, which will be the first time in ever. 
Unfortunately, it doesn't look like there's any more quilts. Just to really piss me off. Oh, no, there is. And you get a pagey for that. So that's what I was thinking. I didn't know whether you got a pagey for getting all of the pages. I mean, all the quilts. So, I will have all of them if I can find the last ghost. Easy. Okay. There seems to be a lot of challenges, which is interesting. It's not what I expected. Hey ah. This room is quite large. Could there be a ghost under here? Oh ho! Oh ho ho ho! Oh, he's a speedy ghost. Thank you. So am I done? Yep. This world is super cleared. Perfect. Exactamo. Uh, so, I guess, just to round this episode off, because it's important and I need to do it, I've needed to do it for a long time. Let's leave this and go back to the very start of the game where we can find that last quill. And maybe do some more stuff besides. Remember when I didn't have a ground pound? It was good times, wasn't it? Okay. Why am I you might be asking what the fuck are you reminiscing about that for? Just, just crossed my mind. It's like when you start in DK64 and you can't ground pound. You're like, really? Donkey Kong can't ground pound? By default? So where's that pipe then? I've just seen it and now I'm going to fucking ignore it again, aren't I? Yeah. Yes, he is. He's going to ignore it. Not intentionally, I'm just not going to see it again. Oh, here it is. Found it. <sighs> Lovely. Right, let's get out of this hell hole. Never to return, for I am finished. Right, goodbye. Right, let's go back to World 1. The fast way to World 1 is to go through the underground watery bit in here. Wherever that's gone. Here. The light is helpful. Either that leads me back to World 1, or this leads me back to World 2. Either way, I can get a pagey from either one. So it's all good. Yeah, this is the World 1 entrance. Okay. So, you might be asking, what page you can get in World 1? Hmm? What are you whistling at me? Don't worry, I'm coming. I'll see what you're, you're whistling. Don't hang on. It's close by. It's close. What is it? Very close. It's above me though, still. Is it? 
No, maybe not. Maybe it's... Maybe it's inside of him. The fuck? The fuck am I gonna get in? There's something going on there. Your amateur moves aren't worth a dime. For a change, I made this taunt. Why? Still can't do anything with that, though. Interestingly enough. When I can do a shoulder barge forward, that'll be when I do that. Let's go get this last chest, wherever it is. I wanted to get out the area quickly because it was lagging my video card, but I, I think I'm fine now. The video card's like a Titan XP, but suddenly it just lags. Maybe the car's just old and it's dying a bit. I can forgive it. It is old. Not dead in the swamp. Good. Boop -ba -doo. Right, so there's going to be a chest somewhere with a quill in it that I never got. Who knows where it's going to be? It's got to explore. Could be somewhere I could have got very easily. Could be somewhere I couldn't get at all. It's up here. I see it already. He's done it. Right, that's that. Hey, Blasto. Hey, Blasto, how are you feeling today? Oh, not so good. My throat hurts. You've almost totally lost my voice. That'll be last night's karaoke. Your performance blew us all away. Oh, I'm not so sure. I think someone held a yellow newspaper this way and I accidentally inhaled it. Oh, I wish there was a hard-hitting cure that could put me back into shape. Uh, I can breathe. Thank you. The AG of Pagey. I knew it was that yellow newspaper. Grab that and pop it in the recycling, would you? Let's see. Hybrid Towers are missing 11 things, but I've got all the... I've got all the quills now. So that's good. Now, what's up here? There's a page up here now that I'm actually expected to get up here. I could have got this from World 1, I guess, when I learned how to roll. I, I guess I actually could have got it from as soon as I went to Highbury Towers. But while I'm here... Nice! You unlocked a new tonic. Pay me a visit. No, I will. Any more that look like they could be here? I don't think so. I think that's I think that's it for this zone. Two pages is pretty good. So my crew count is more reflective of an actual amount now. Rather than some fake amount. What I mean by that is I won't just have 231 or like 229 and that's okay. I should have an even number. Well, but minus one. Because I should have 206. What new tonic have you got on offer for me, my dear? Nice to see you, kids. Here to swap out your tonic. Well, odd. What do I unlock? Ten inept enemies. Hmm. Don't know. Right. Either way, I'm gonna go to World Two. The reason why is because there's another pagey I can get, at least one, maybe two. I figured out how to do it. That slope that we're was in, like a sideways metal slope. Even though I could roll or slipping down it, I just need to honey. I just need to find some honey and I'll be good. I think there's some honey literally right on the way as well. Try to learn to glide, of course. The overpowered glide. There's some honey right here, look. 
All you need to do is get this honey. Fuck off. Okay. We move it. And then slide up here. I'm guessing. Yep. Nice. I could just, oh, I could have actually just walked up it. I'm so sticky. Now, what I don't know is how to get here. It's probably a shortcut back to World 2 from World 5 or 4. But I'm currently unsure as to the specifics of that arrangement. Now, these pipes look very climbable. Like... You know, some things look climbable, but don't look explicitly climbable. This looks explicitly like the game wants me to climb it. Yeah. He's done it. While I'm here, you know. While I'm here. Okay, so. I'm going to end this episode here. Because I'm about time now, I think. Even with my little bathroom break. Uh, so I'm going to go back to World 3. And then forward to World 4. For now. Until I learn all the moves in the game, I think. And then I'll go backwards. There's only a couple moves left, so. Let's just move forward before I forget what I'm doing. Jetpacks and Butters is a good book name. <sighs> Lovely. Right. Yeah, I still can't believe the game didn't expect me to have the tongue ability by now. Like, of course I was going to cheat. You gave me the option. Never give Joey the option to cheat. He'll take it. Okay. I'm just going to get to a suitable place to stop for the day so I don't have to start the next episode with two minutes of walking towards the fucking destination. You just put it you put it on the end of the old episode. That's that's my strategy. Maybe it's a bad one. Works for me though. We're moving. Max speed. One page I still have no idea how to fucking get. Is the uh Is the uh page where you have to get to the top of the ice mountain. No idea how to get up there. All I'm thinking is that eventually I just learn the ability to straight up fly. If I learn the ability to straight up fly, then I'll be good. Right, so. Here we are. Capital Cashino. I'm going to start with this next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you then. Goodbye. <laughs>